Hey, what's up guys? My name is the number one Pred, and today what I'll be bringing you guys is a double chem strike using the Maverick with the support package. So it's a bit of a different gameplay actually, not to mention this gameplay was on the map Tremor. So it's actually yeah, a very different gameplay from what I normally post, you know, Sanders free fall, strike zone, honey badger you know AK12 so it's a little bit different hope you guys enjoy the gameplay for those who are wondering why I'm using the Maverick because I've never actually used it before um, like it was in one of my episodes of your gun my chem but other than that I've never had a Maverick gameplay on my channel and the reason why that is is because I had the DLC at some point the first DLC which is the one the Maverick came with and um, I didn't like the DLC because the maps were awful in my opinion and the gun wasn't too great if it, if a gun was a mate like good then it probably would have convinced me to keep the map pack but it wasn't amazing so I decided to delete it um, thinking that it'll be good and dandy but unfortunately at the time now where everything's getting stale and boring including the honey badger even I'm getting a bit bored of using it now I thought I'm gonna re-download it and use the Maverick so I hop on a few games later after downloading it and I get this one so hopefully you guys enjoy the gameplay I was using the support package because people were suggesting or you know asking me to do gameplays other than um, you know specialist and um, you know honey Roger and stuff like that so I wanted to use a support package because it's kinda useful I was playing with two other friends I was playing with I Carnage who died four off and um, Kenko who died one off so they're both choked in the game which is unfortunate and look how OP the ball is it's ridiculous but yeah, that's basically it for the gameplay. Make sure to drop a like rating down below if you do enjoy. Let's try and reach this video to 40 likes. That'd be insane. Hopefully you guys will be able to do that. If not, that's completely okay and fine. But it'd be a nice goal to set ourselves for. So that'd be sick. And uh, I'm going to get straight into the commentary topic. And believe it or not, the commentary topic is something different than the gameplay. Woo! And um, this one's to do with school stories, and I might do like a little mini commentary topic series. It's not going to be like titled or anything, but you know, just every now and again, I'll just post like a, st a school stories or something like that. Talk about something that f funny or eventful that happened in school. And um, so I'm going to kick it off today with something that's not, you know, amazing or anything, you know, special. It's kind of, it was funny for me. Personally, I found it really, really funny. You guys may not find it funny. You may find it funny. But you had to be in the place at the same time to be tearing. Literally, you guys would be creasing up so hard if you had like, a similar sense of humor as me um, at the time. So basically what happened is me and... Um, my friend Pure, Carnage Pure, uh, we know each other in real life by the way, we um, actually go to the same school and um, you know, the same class, um, we're not mates because I'm his school bully pretty much, <laughs> nah I'm just joking, I mean I do bully him but he, uh, we are mates so, um, we're in the same class and uh, you know, me and him, we're not you know the most sensible people in class, we don't normally listen, we usually cause drama with other people. <coughs> Anthony and um, we just like we just like to wind up so literally we'll wind other people up and um, so that's what we do we, we were in a different classroom we were in a um, supply room with a supply teacher so me and him probably would have fallen in our heads oh let's, let's go we can do whatever we want um, we can wind up whoever we want and get away with it so um, we were in the classroom but believe it or not this story does not evolve around us so much so basically what happened is we were in our class, we were sitting there doing work, worksheets, boring old shit that, you know, we get off the uh, teacher's plan because obviously it's a supply teacher. And let me just let you, let you guys know that this teacher is really weird. She's not, she's not, you know, correct in the mind. She wears sunglasses, yes, sunglasses indoors. Now that's weird, that's kind of weird, you can't say that's normal. And literally, the school's not bright. It's literally an old, you know. When was this school made? It was probably like it, it, we had like a hundred year anniversary, like a couple of year or a year ago. So it's it's really really old building, and um, so I don't see, feel the need of like. But there's no need to wear glasses or sunglasses because it's not even bright. Let's put it that way. It's a dull, boring, our shitty school uh, building, if you ask me. So basically, what happened? Uh, enough about the teacher, obviously. Is that there's a t there's a guy student who oh, I know and I'm you know I get on well with, who sits at the back of the room, um, with his friends because obviously we get along but you know we're not you know, in the same friend group or whatever. So um, 
he's like sort of the class clown. He makes jokes, it's funny and that. And um, he's extremely, extremely loud and chatty. And him and his friends were sitting at the back of the classroom making honking noises and, you know, random weird ass stupid noises and uh, just non stop talking. And they were loud enough to, you know, alert the teacher and she was getting pissed off because she, she has a really bad temper at times um, so she gets pissed off rather easily and obviously he you know pissed her off so she told him off said next time you do it you will be moved to the front with her and um, he did it obviously and uh, she moved him to the front with her so um, that's not the funny bit what the funny bit is is that you know because obviously I get on well with him we have a laugh normally uh, me and him were exchanging funny glances, you know, making noises at each other, um, you know, typical immature stuff that we, uh, you know, us teenage lads always do. Um, we were smirking, laughing, because obviously I was listening in what he was doing, it was kind of funny. And the teacher was starting to get pissed off majorly, and she snapped, she snapped to him, not on me, because obviously he was the one in trouble, not me. And um, she snapped at him and was like, Oh my god, why are you being such a King Kong? And, um, honestly, you don't, every day, I mean, it's not every day you get a teacher calling someone King Kong. King Kong, a gorilla, a fucking monkey. And let's say this guy, he is a bit tubby. He's not fat, he's just a little bit tubby. And I thought he would have taken a bit of offence, which he, I, I believe he did. And I just could not stop laughing. I was literally tearing it. My eyes, I could probably fill up a swimming pool with my tears of joy. Me and Pure, or Harry, which is what his real name goes by, um, we could not stop laughing. I couldn't stop laughing for the rest of the lesson. The teacher was starting to get pissed off with me because I was not stop laughing. I couldn't concentrate on my work. I had my uh, head buried in my arms and the paper that I was working on was literally wet and, uh, you know, extremely damp from my tears of laughter and it was the funniest lesson ever I'm not even joking I'm not the person who you get you know cracking up majorly I'm normally a person who go like <laughs> you know every now and again if you guys know what I mean like the normal chuckle or smirk but um, that time I was overloaded with tears and laughter it was so funny um, hopefully you guys enjoyed today's commentary topic it was really really funny time for me hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay as well make sure to drop a like comment and subscribe and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.